tip number 24, place reference point the x0, y0 point of a footprint for SMT components to the middle of the component or consider to place it into center of gravity. Whew, this is a long one, but it's not so difficult. I'm going to explain. And uh, for this uh, explanation, I'm going to use Altium Designer, but uh, I think it works probably very similar also in the other systems. When you open a footprint library like this, there is always a grid and uh, you can read the position of the cursor. Yeah, Always when you move cursor somewhere here in the library, you can read the position of the cursor. In the Altium, it is down here. So if I put the cursor here, the position is minus 265, 70. And there is one very special point. Which one do you know? The point which is 0, 0. In this footprint, it is this point here. Can you see? This is position of the cursor 0, 0. This point, 0, 0, is, coin, is called reference point. And uh, it doesn't have to be in the middle. It can be also in some other positions. What is the other standard position or very common use position for this reference point? Do you know? Pin number one, yeah. But for SMT components, surface mount components, I always place the reference point into middle of the component because this point is also listed in the pick and place files. So when you generate manufacturing files from your PCB, this point is, uh, is used in these files and it can be then used for the pick and place machines to tell them where they should pick up the component and where, she, where they should put it on the PCB. I'm going to show you, okay? This, yeah? This is the machine and it is going to pick up this processor. So what do you think where I set up the reference point of the processor? Where this machine is going to pick up the processor? In the middle, yeah, watch. Yeah. And uh, if you have a look on the PCB, I go inside the PCB. This is the footprint. If I double click on this component, the position of this component is the position of the reference point. So it says position is 15.4, 30. And if you remember right, the reference point is in the middle of this component. So if I go somewhere in the middle, the position of this cursor should be 15.430. Yeah. So that's the point where the reference point of this footprint is located. That's the position of this component. I'm going to show you how the pick and place file may look so you can see how it is then used in these uh, output files and uh, then you will understand why it is useful to place the reference point uh, uh, inside or in the middle of the component in the center of the component or sometimes it will be different tip for true hole components I use it on pin number one I will then explain why so this is the pick and place file. If I open it, here you can see uh, all the components and here are different positions. This is always the position of the middle of the component, but here this is the position of the reference point. So for this U2, it, I think it is U2, okay. For this U2 component, you can see this is the U2. The reference point is 15.430. Okay, so these columns are then used in the assembly house 
and this column is used to fill up the assembly machine with the position of the components and with the information where they should pick up the component. Normally, as I said, for the SMT components, you would like to use the center. Sometimes, uh, if the component is not, uh, if it doesn't have like, um, if it has special shape, then instead of using the center of the component, you may use what? Do you remember from the tip? Center of gro gravity, okay? Normally, center of gravity is exactly in the middle of the component because they are usually symmetrical. But if they are not symmetrical, consider using the center of the gravity. Why? Do you know why? Because when the machine pick up the component, you don't want fell off the component of the of the tip from the machine, okay? That's why you then maybe you would like to use the uh, center of the gravity. Don't forget tip number 24, place reference point the X0, Y0 point of a footprint for SMT components to the middle of the component or consider to place it into center of gravity. Why? This reference point is very often used in pick and place output files. This means when doing assembly machine, we'll pick up the component at this 0, 0 position.